doing his pelvis for some reason. Oh, they're sticking behind his back. There we go. Now the rib cage here, you can see how uh, much volume it has to it. And anything that affects our breathing and uh, tightens us, all these muscles between the ribs, or anything that affects the spine can start to drop this down. And uh, this first rib angle up here, when that drops down, you get a pooch belly, your breasts start to droop, and everything collapses down really. So there are loads of things that affect that. What I'm going to do is give you a quick exercise to lift everything up. Quick exercise. This is going to take 20 seconds. So I've got a, um, I'm here in my kitchen. So you're going to stand in a doorway. Everyone's got a doorway in, doorway in the house. We're going to start off by doing the left arm. So I'm going to place my hand up here and I'm going to step forward with the left leg. Now this is very much like walking, so that's, that's why I want you to step forward with the left leg. Now you can keep your uh, elbow bent, and I'm just going to come forward until I feel a little bit of a stretch here. So some of you might want to straighten their arm a little bit more, some might want to bend it. Just as long as you're being very, very easy on the body and, and there's no pain. So I've got a little stretch here, and now what I'm going to do is very gently look down, and look up. So I'm, my head's going down and then coming back up. I'm going to do ten of those. And I'm feeling a nice stretch here, nothing too strong. And then I'm going to go side to side. Again, I'm feeling a very gentle stretch here, no pain anywhere. I'm keeping the stretch on. If I feel it loosening off, I just lean forward more into the, into uh, this way into the straight, and then I'm going to do ten where I look around, sort of in a rotation manner. I think that's about ten. So that was really quick. Now I don't know if you can see that. Uh, if the camera person can nod up and down, if they can, you see that my that shoulder's way back and this shoulder is coming forward, I've already lifted my chest muscle up. My chest is higher on this side, but I can't walk around like uh, this all day, so I'm just going to turn my back to you and do the other side. So, right hand comes up, right leg steps forward, I start off by going backwards and forwards for 10, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, side to side, 1, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and then around the corner. Just keeping a nice stretch on the on the chest muscle here. And uh, you, you, I don't know if you can see that with my black t-shirt, but my chest is already lifted up, and I'm, I can't not have it up. So that's a very simple exercise for switching on all the little computers in here that go to sleep because of all the pressures, too much computer, bad food, and the way we move. And it just switches them on. They go, oh, thank goodness you've switched me on. This is what I'm supposed to do. And if you do this every day, when you're walking, because they're now switched on, you'll walk and you'll start to get a little bit of switching on when you're walking every day. <clears throat> so the muscles literally learn how to come back into how the body moves. And you, after a while you won't have to do this anymore. The breast tissue will lift up, your shoulders will come back, and your whole posture will lengthen. So that's just a simple 20 second technique you can do in the morning or in the evening. And uh, I, hope, I hope you enjoy